Hi everyone, this is John Walker with Talent Evolution and in this video tutorial I'm going to show you how to share your email or announcement in uh, Constant Contact and posting it to Facebook. So here I am inside of my dashboard, my Constant Contact dashboard. I already have an email in draft. So what I am going to do next is I'm going to bring this up into my edit screen and I'm just going to review just to make sure I have everything set right. For example, I have my from name, my subject line, my pre-header text, my reply. I'm using my social share bar here up at the top. I've got my logo, my image. Uh, links. I've already checked these links to make sure that they are going to the correct spot. And I'll make sure my images are tagged. But everything here is ready to go to the next step. So I'm, I'm happy with the way this email looks. So now I'm getting ready to schedule it to send it out. So on the next screen, I'm coming up to my scheduling tool. And again, here I'm going to make sure that everything is uh, in order. I'm going to select a list. And for this purpose, I'm just going to send it to myself. So let's see here. Where am I? There it is. I'm going to select my list. Hit save. Make sure it's up here at the top. And then I'm going to double check my subject line, my preheader text, the from line. I'm going to make sure my from emails are correct. I'm going to go back up here. I'm going to make sure I have um, whichever scheduling option I'd like. I'm going to send it now. Here also I'm going to make sure I get my early results sent to me. And I'm going to have this campaign set up for Google Analytics tracking. So I'm going to call this uh, June workshop schedule and I'll be able to track this in Google Analytics so everything is set so right down here I'm going to look at this uh, it's called the uh, simple share and now that I have gotten everything in place I'm going to go back up here to schedule I'm going to hit the schedule button it is going to go out now or within 10 minutes and now down here where the social sharing or the simple share um, option was I have a new selection and so here is where I'm going to schedule my post and as you can see I just click on schedule post and since I have four events that I'm covering in my email, I'm going to schedule a Facebook post for each of those. So this is what I'm going to do. And as you can see, I have, uh, you know, schedule. The schedule below is based on social marketing best practices. But I'm going to go ahead and look at this. And here's the calendar where I can see, where I can select dates that I want to run, how many posts I want to run in that date. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to start here. So my first post I'm going to schedule for today. And I'm going to have it go out to the Talent Evolution website and the Talent Evolution uh, Twitter account. I can also add uh, LinkedIn. Uh, let me go ahead and do that. So what I'm going to do is go here to options. And go here to social accounts. Let's see, I'm going to click on LinkedIn, which is going to take me over here to the LinkedIn bar. I'm going to put in my my username and LinkedIn password. I'm 
I'm going to hit allow. And then that's going to add the LinkedIn option here. So now when I go up here to add, I can add LinkedIn. So I'm going to add this to my LinkedIn account, my Twitter account, or Talent Evolutions Twitter account, and uh, also the Talent Evolution Facebook page. So now that I've got my options set, I'm going to go here and set my message. So the first one, which is going out today, is just going to say, check out the check out our June workshops, digital marketing at its best for small business owners. And here you can see I've already got my shortened URL. And actually I'm gonna change this because this is going to be in San Diego and Las Vegas. Now you notice I went over in in my word count. So I'm going to change this just a little bit. So maybe I'll just forget about the location because that's going to be in the email. So I'm just going to say digital marketing. I'm going to change this digital marketing training for small business owners. And then I'm going to select a photo. So what I'm going to do here is I'm going to click on this image. It's going to take me to my library. And here I'm going to select upcoming events and workshops. Alrighty, so I'm going to use that image. And I size this image to the Facebook standard 1200 pixels by 628. And that's important because you want this to show up in the Facebook timeline so that it looks nice. So I'm going to use that. And I'm going to schedule this one to go out at, let's see, at 604, at 609 today. And then I'm going to change the schedule here. I'm not going to, let's see, and then the next one I'm going to do, let's see, the next one is June 8th on my schedule is the event. So I'm going to schedule that a couple days beforehand. So I'm going to do it on Monday. And as you notice, that will change. Let's see, I'm going to get rid of this one. Oh, let's see. I'm going to remove that post. I'm going to remove the 28th. I'm going to remove the 31st. And now I'm going to go with the 6th. So on this one is going to be another post. So this one is uh, Grow Your Business with email and social media marketing learn tips to succeed and grow alrighty and now I'm going to change the image on this one And I'm going to use this image right here. And I'm going to make sure that I have the accounts that I want selected. I'm just going to post that to Talent Evolution. And I'm going to have that. Actually, I'm going to change the schedule. One of the things you can do is change when you want it to go out. So 10 o'clock. Yeah, that's a good time. I'm going to have it go out at 10. 
and you can see I had three characters to spare. So I'm going to add another menu item. So the next workshop is on the 14th. So I'm going to schedule this one to go out on Friday, the 10th. So I'm going to add that. So on the 10th, I'm just going to, and you notice it copied what I had here before as the image. But I'm going to click on the icon and change the image. And I'm going to change it to this one. It is the same workshop, but in a different location. So this one is on the 14th. And I'm going to say something just a little bit different. It's actually the same workshop. So learn how to grow your business using email and social media marketing. All right, got that post. And I have one more. Oh, let's see, which date was that? That was the 14th. Oh, I have one on the 16th, which is an email marketing one. So I'm gonna add, let's see. So I'm gonna give myself a couple days to post that. So I'm gonna do that one on the 14th. And on the 14th, Again, I'm just going to make sure I got all the correct account selected. I'm going to schedule this one to go out. This one is going to be content marketing, I believe. So again, I'm going to select the photo that I want to use for my image. I'm going to insert there. I'm going to use content marketing. Learn what to say and how to say it. Content marketing for small business owners. <clears throat> And you notice the shortened URL is dropped in at each instance of my post. And I'm going to schedule this one to go out in the afternoon. So I'm going to select oh, 1.30. One way to get an idea of when to schedule your post is to look at your Facebook Insights. That will be very helpful. And the next one, let's see, is the 27th, or actually the 21st, I believe. So I'm going to schedule this one. This is going to be, or actually the 27th is my next one. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to schedule this one to go out on the 23rd and this is going to be the webinar post so again I'm going to change my image I'm going to select webinar oops I did the wrong one so let me go back I think that's the right one. Yes. Content. Okay. Now I'm going to go back to my webinar one. And I'm going to change that because I'm promoting my webinar, which will be taking place on the 27th. So this one's going to be learn the ins and outs of constant contact. Live demo to help you grow your business. 
or actually let's do this um, live demo of the email marketing platform there we go and I'm still within my character range. One of the reasons why this is a short character range is because of Twitter. We wanted to make sure that it stays within the 140 character limit. So if I did take off Twitter as a source for my posting there, it will uh, definitely make that longer. So one thing that you might want to do is just schedule some posts for Facebook and some posts for Twitter if you want it to be longer. So I'm just going to uncheck these to make sure I'm good. I'm going to uh, just double check, make sure all my images and everything are fine. And then I am going to hit everything looks great. Now I'm going to hit schedule. So let's see the results. So here I am on our Facebook timeline for Talent Evolution, and there is our first post. And as you can see, it's got the, the, um, the content there, states that it's coming from the Simple Share by Constant Contact. And here is the content. And when I click on the image, it'll take me right to the web page version of this email and here you are you can see everything right here and you notice too that this is built for sharing and also join my list now if I go over to Twitter because remember we posted it to Twitter as well you can see the Twitter post and also the link that goes right back to that email and then also on LinkedIn so when I go to LinkedIn my LinkedIn timeline I click on the information there and it goes right back to that email where people can register for upcoming events and there you have it folks a great way to turn your constant contact email into social media content that can be shared across Facebook, LinkedIn, Twitter. And if you have any questions about uh, what I've just shown you or wanting to know how you can do it yourself, uh, please give me a, a, a call or send me an email. My phone number is 858-324-4259 or you can reach me at john at talentevolution com and of course if you are new to constant contact I'd be happy to get you started with constant contact and uh, help you create great content uh, uh, like this from the emails that you create within constant contact so again good luck to you in your marketing and I'll be talking to you again soon